Well, this season my Brussels sprouts almost made it. Now, as you can see, they're drooping a little bit. It's cold in here right now. It's about all 30 or 28 degrees, something like that. That's Fahrenheit. And uh, it's the middle of December. And there's just not enough time for these things to grow yet. Now, let me show you what happened, what I did wrong with these, and I think I know how to fix it for next season so I can grow Brussels sprouts, which we, we really like. Now the first photo I have of this Brussels sprouts plant was uh, dated the 5th of June here. And a few days later here, on the 11th of June, I had another shot of it right here. See, it's a little bigger now. Now, I needed to figure out when this thing was planted because I didn't plant it. It was a, a volunteer. So I have to kind of estimate when was it planted. And looking at this, I'd have to estimate about the middle of May was when it was planted. And actually, that's too late. Now, the next photo I have of it was on the 25th of September. And you can see it's grown quite a bit through the heat of the summer. And this greenhouse gets a little too warm in the summertime. And here if we go into the, a, a few days later to the 30th of September, you can see from another vantage point that uh, you know, it did grow quite well, but, and up until this point. Now the next picture I have is dated the 12th of December, and you can see from looking at this that the Brussels sprouts themselves, the little sprouts, are forming rather nicely but it's just too cold in here for them to keep growing and they have stopped and they've been stopped oh I don't know for uh, about three weeks or two weeks something like that they haven't been growing at all in here because it's just been getting too cold I even pull them off once in a while to sample them and they taste pretty good but what I'm thinking here is if it hadn't gotten cold in the greenhouse you know because winter is coming these Brussels sprouts would have matured nicely. I'm just chewing here on one of these Brussels sprouts. Even though they're pretty little, they're still pretty good. Anyway, what was done wrong here was these Brussels sprouts, I think, were planted too late. Now, they are volunteers, so they planted themselves, but planting them in the middle of May or something like that is just too late out here in this greenhouse environment. So, and also, uh, it got cold too quick later on at the other end of the season. I mean, these are maturing nicely, but if they had another month, I think, of reasonably warm weather, and I'm saying, you know, maybe 75, 80 degrees Fahrenheit here in the greenhouse, these would have probably matured. And we'd have a whole lot of little Brussels sprouts to eat, big ones. So, what I'm going to do next year is... Uh, is start some seedlings oh probably in April or first of April and get them to grow you know maybe this tall and then hopefully in the first of May or the first part of May transplant them out here where this one started growing from seed in uh, you know May sometime that should give it enough time to grow through the season to grow a big healthy stock and then uh, when the when the uh, Brussels sprouts start uh, coming on to the uh, stalks, there should be enough time where the season is still warm, but not hot. But the season is still warm where these can mature. So that's what I'm going to try to do. There's a guy here in town who uh, uh, grows uh, uh, things like this, and boy, he is good at it. Now he doesn't have a greenhouse, but he says the secret to growing these things is to uh, uh, is to let them grow, in other words, let the stalks grow when the weather is quite warm. And that way the stalks grow really fast and, uh, you know, they get strong and sturdy and, and all that sort of stuff. And then what you want it to do is have the weather cool off. And when I say cool off, I'm talking about 75, 80 degrees and a little, maybe a little cooler than that, but around that, around that temperature. You want it to cool off when these uh, Brussels sprout, uh, sprouts start to form because that's when it'll bolt if it's hot and these are forming apparently that'll make it bolt but if you can just keep it cool enough to stop it from bolting these should mature 
But so, uh, but in this greenhouse, you know, that means that I've got to plant it a, a lot earlier, and then uh, hopefully be able to harvest these in September, maybe or maybe October, but no later than that because then it'll be too cold in here for them to continue to grow. So that's what I'm gonna do next year. So um, these are kind of tricky to do, but next year we'll see what happens.